know what couscous is? That poppy seeds? We use it in our day-to-day -day life, but ever wondered getting into jail because of that? Yes, you heard me right. 2014 ki baat hai, there was an Indian guy from Mangalore who boarded a flight to Dubai on Emirates and he was carrying couscous or poppy seeds in his luggage. 100 grams he was carrying without even knowing that Dubai mein ya UA mein it is banned. And the consequences, he got jailed carrying that poppy seeds because he was not knowing that it's illegal to carry that thing. Sometimes we act over smart or sometimes we are very innocent, we don't know what is necessary to take or what is not. And we end up in trouble. This video will help you in shedding some light how to travel safely. Now let's talk about something serious that you might encounter at the airport besides carrying those duty-free chocolates or alcohol or the long queues. One thing Indians are very commonly known for is carrying their spices in the luggage. There are other lot of items, food items or spices which can land you in trouble in other countries. An article by an Indian news national confirmed that 1,358 people identifying themselves as Indian nationals on their arrival cards received infringement notices of $444 for bringing prohibited food items during the 2019-20 financial year. On my screen is a table showing the percentage of all undeclared commodities brought in by Indian national who received these notices. These are the top three items which were identified from this table. First one is of course the spices and herbs. Hamai tulsi hogi, hamara dhania ya all that thing. Garam masala. Second one is about legumes. Legumes are our lentils, dal ho gaya hai, chane ho gaye hai, all those type of things. Third item is tulsi ke beach. Hum Indians tulsi ke beach India se le aate hai apne luggage mein and we don't know that it's not allowed overseas. Moving on to the next issue is cigarettes. People are found with bulk quantities of cigarettes. They Either they are transporting overseas or bringing into India. We all know that cigarettes are very mangy abhar. Actually, India is mangy, the world is mangy. So that's why they think if they are going to the country, they are going to the cigarette, then why not to bring all the cigarettes in our luggage? No, this is wrong. Example, case of 13 Indian passengers found carrying 60 lakh rupees worth of cigarette sticks who were arrested at Delhi airport. They were intercepted by officials after arriving from Dubai and all of them were arrested. But the cigarette is not here. In September 2023, 113 passengers were in Chennai and they were caught with cash and gold in their luggage and they were intercepted by Indian customs and they found all the things. So please, over smart mat bano. Cash leke aare ho, soch rahe ho ki metal nahi hai, to pata nahi lagega. No, they have all the trackers, all the tracers and be very careful. Let's talk about some more serious things. Aap sab ko pata hai kya hai? Agar nahi pata hai, mein batata hu. It's a Singapore arrival card. Ye card, har passenger ko bhanna padta hai. Either they are coming via ship or by an airplane. इस कार्ड में आपकी डिटेल्स पूछते हैं वो कि आपका नाम क्या है क्यों आए हो कितने दिन के लिए रहोगे और कुछ ऐसा है जो आप कैरी कर रहे हो नाउ फ्लिप इट टू द बैक साइड ऑफ दिस कार्ड इट क्लियरली सेज अ वार्निंग इन बोल्ड रेड and in caps, it says warning, death for drug trafficking under Singapore law. इसका मतलब समझ आया? Carrying drugs means death penalty. कोई सुनवाई नहीं. And this is something Few people, including Indians, were executed in Singapore. And one of the example is Nagain. A mentally challenged, 24 saal ka larka, Indian origin Malaysian, was found guilty of drug trafficking. And guess what? He was hanged till death. Usne 42 grams of heroin smuggled kari Singapore mein. He was on death row for a decade and exhausted all legal resources. Uski sari ki sari help, sari legal aid, sab khatam ho chuki thi. Richard Branson, a billionaire founder of Virgin Group, usne bhi apni sympathy dikhai towards him that Singapore is breaking human rights thing, not to hang him, etc. Usne LinkedIn pe bhi ye article dala aur uspe bahut saare responses the. People were in favor of him, but people were also against him. 
Another incident involved Raju. He's also from India. A 46-year-old man from India was executed at Changi Prison Complex in Singapore for drug consumption and failure to report for a drug test. His struggles with the law began in 2014 when he was detained for using drugs and not taking a drug test. Things are very bad. In 2018, he was sentenced to death for carrying one kg of cannabis into Singapore. I ask you, what is right? Are these people's execution right? Or the border force is protecting their country? That's right. This is a very controversial question, but I want to hear from you. Because I want to show you the other perspective of this case. Singapore is a very small country. People are illegal drugs. There is a small population. सोचो क्या हाल होगा उस कंट्री की इकोनॉमी और इकोसिस्टम का अगर ड्रग्स आ गए और छोटी सी पापुलेशन है और उसको इन्फेक्ट कर गए इसीलिए सिंगापुर इज़ ए स्मॉल कंट्री वो अपनी कंट्री को प्रोटेक्ट कर रहे हैं साफ़ साफ़ लिखा हुआ है डेथ्स if you are carrying illegal drugs. So, decision is all yours. What is your perspective? Is it right or wrong? Foreign bugs, hitchhiking and luggage have wreaked havoc in the U.S. before. Florida's orange and grapefruit growers lost $2.9 billion from 2007 to 2014, thanks to the Asian citrus psyllid. And since being introduced into the U.S. in the 90s, the Asian longhorn beetle has ravaged hardwood trees. Eradication efforts between 1997 and 2010 cost more than $373 million. Another interesting incident is about kangaroos and wallabies. Kangaroo se aapko kaun se country yaad aati hai? Ham sabko pata hai it's Australia. But have you ever heard kangaroos and New Zealand? I'm sure not. If yes, in a negative term. So my friends, New Zealand mein kangaroos illegally lie gaye the aur aaj bhi wahan pe kabhi kabhar kangaroos dikhte hain. And it's a serious threat for them and even considered as a pest for the farmers. Reason is simple. Hai. New Zealand ki farming is different, land is different, the weather is different. And those kangaroos come and eat their food and it's not good for them. And they don't want to consider themselves as a New Zealander with kangaroos. But it's just simple. Itni hai. Now comes the most important part of this video. Isko please dhyan se sunna. That can save your life. Number one, my friends, never ever, never ever carry someone's luggage before knowing what it is inside. Chahe wo aapka saga bhai hai, behen hai, bohot jigri dost hai, ya close relative hai, you never know uske andar kya hai. Packet de diya ki ye aap Sydney le jana, New York le jana, uske andar kuch bhi ho sakta hai. So please openly bolo ki packet open karke do. I want to see what I'm going to take just because of security concerns. So that is a simple reason you can land in trouble. If you don't have seen what you're going to take, there are a lot of incidents that have been done. So yeah, that's the first one and the most important tip. Second point is about incoming arrival passenger card. Honestly declare what you're bringing. Reason will help you a lot. I'll tell you the reason. If you're taking medicine and if you have seeds or nuts, and it's written in the card, that are you bringing these items? And you're over smart that I don't write and I'll go out. But the problem is this, that you're thinking about this card. It is a declaration. कि आप ये चीज लेके आ रहे हो अगर आपने सिंपल यस करा कि हाँ मैं लेके आ रहा हूँ वो आपको उठा के जेल में नहीं डाल देंगे इट इज अबाउट देयर डिसीजन कि वो देखेंगे कि हाँ ठीक है बीच लेके आ रहे हो या नट्स हैं नट्स कौन से हैं आमंड्स हैं या काजू हैं तो देखेंगे अगर अलाउड होगा तो लेके जाने देंगे अगर नहीं अलाउड होगा तो कहेंगे यार सॉरी आप लेगा ले जा नहीं सकते बट यू आर बींग ऑनेस्ट वो आपको चार्ज नहीं करेंगे पेनल्टी नहीं करेंगे एंड इन ऑपोजिट टू इट अगर आप हीरो बने या आप स्मार्ट बने आपने डिक्लेयर नहीं किया और उन्होंने पकड़ा कि हाँ आपके पास बीच yeah, nuts hai. Then you will get penalized. So my friends, that's the second tip and always abide the rules. These rules are for your security as well as the country's security as well. Talking about this incoming card, I have also faced a lot of things that in the flight, many people are helping me. They are saying, son, please come to me, please come to me, I don't have to come to me, I'm first time traveling. I think it's very important for me to create a video on this, how to fill this incoming passenger card, so that next time, people need to help me, how to fill it and what is the purpose of it. So once it will be out, the link will be up here. So stay tuned. Five countries I'll be covering, India, US, Canada, Australia, and UK. So my friends, I really hope that you have been informative of this video. There are some comments and some feedback that I want to listen to you from you. Please comment down below. Because this is a very serious topic. A person can land in jail or be in the trouble. 
or can be successful in traveling. So, see you next time.